There's a new way to take on trick-or-treating at your home. Yeah, Stephanie <laughs> Pena Frost is here to show us how. Oh, yes. So many fun ideas to jazz up. And this is, it is. you know, if you're if you're not handing out a whole lot of candy, this is a great it's idea. Creative, right? It is. I mean, how many times do you just like grab and mm -hmm. put into the bucket? Well, right. why not grab and hand it to them? And they'll uh, be so uh, excited or have it be like the prize for the best, co yes. the best costume. So this is a really cute way to do it. Um, I just bought a big bag, but make sure you want to get the ones that have the bigger pouches to the bigger pouch flat ones to mm -hmm, it, mm -hmm. and then um, I found one that had the Tootsie Rolls, and they make the great the the the, the best legs. And then you want to <laughs> kind of f find some fun ways to do the arms, and it's super easy. You do the base first, and then you go back over. You let you let that kind of dry. That way you don't burn yourself. And then you do this. It's not a kid activity. It's definitely one that you want to. Um, it's more of an adult because of the glue part. But the kids will definitely love getting it and and playing with it. And it's just so much fun. They're just so they're so silly. Creative. And so you almost and don't you want get to a lot. Eat yeah. Right. And you get a lot. Mm -hmm. And you almost don't want to take them apart. But right. once, yeah, once you tear into it, it's it's all over. You're done. You're done. And then um, the other thing, the other one is this fun little cone. This is also good. For um, for parties or for uh, your your school, like mm -hmm. if you're sending kit, the treats to, to the teachers at school, you get um, that, that they use the double sided scrapbook paper, mm -hmm. cut it into it's about six by six. I like to use the clip here, and you can do this one. Okay. And you want to glue right on the inside and down, and mm -hmm. then um, use the clip to hold it on top. Mm -hmm. And if you don't have the double sided scrapbook paper, I got the single sided and then I glued just a piece oh, yeah. to it on the inside to kind of give it that look. Could always find a mm -hmm. way, yes. You can put paper in there, you can put toys in there, you can put treats in there, you, you can jazz them up by putting glitter and different fun embellishments on the outside and then you take these and then underneath there's a, a, a little oh, bucket of candy down there. Yeah, a little stash down here. And you oh, can, oh. here you go, you can put them in one of these, put it in one of the done ones and then uh, kind of stick a little a little cute. pick in there to make it really yes. cute. And it's just a fun way to give another so gift. Cute. It's a fun way to kind of present the candy. And that's what it's all about. Especially, yes. like I said, if you don't have a lot of kids coming to your door or if you're having a party for your kids. Right, or a party, yes. Mm -hmm. And then the other thing is what we did um, mm -hmm. earlier. Mm -hmm. So uh, here's one that's that started. And it, it, this one is, once again, is another one that's a little bit trickier. Mm -hmm. You can come in here and you could uh, work on tying this to the tying it to the um, to the wreath, the pumpkin wreath. And uh, you can do it either wrap it in cellophane and then the tissue paper or just do it this way with the paper. It makes I feel it like easier. you could even switch out this with like some cute ribbon if you, you really can. wanted to. You can, yeah. If you have some fun ribbon that, that's laying around, kind of anything extra, you can really jazz it up and make it make it larger and make it a lot more fun that way too. And with a quick color change and stuff, I mean, you could do this for anything. Christmas or... You could do it for Christmas, you could do it for Valentine's yeah. Day. You mm -hmm. could do it just oh, yeah. because Mother's Day, mm -hmm. kind of anything. And it's a, it's a nice base and a nice way to really kind of can I take what you already have and what yeah. you already know and how do, how do you make it special for the holidays? And everybody loves these. I know. <laughs> They're Who so doesn't good? love They're them. They're so good. And real quickly, where yes. will you be next? So mm -hmm. um, this Wednesday I will be at the Pearl Market for their uh, for the harvest market and then for the holiday markets as well. And then I have a full schedule of a bunch of different markets during the weekend. So okay. I'm nice and, and this busy. is what you're working on, right? This is what I'm working on. So I have these cute little, they're little gnome, little gnome boards. They're made out of cedar. You can be inside or outside. Cute. I have some of the little uh, uh, cats and pumpkins left as well. So just kind of so cute. silly, silly things. Oh, and like Jen said earlier, you can put the little googly eyes on these to make it. Yes, yes, yes for that. Yes. Too cute. All right, for more information on Stephanie Pena Frost and Princess and the Monkey Home Decor, you know what to do.